Good morning, everybody. Uh, this is Janice again from Measuring to Fit. I help people get started on the um, sewing. Actually, what I focus on is beginner sewing. So all that I talk about, I like to focus only on beginner sewing. And um, I have informed some of you about my live stream, but I'm not going to... <coughs> Excuse me, I'm not going to wait around for whoever is coming on because I find that uh, doing live stream uh, uh, saves a bit of a time uh, for me uh, in terms of uh, having to do the video, edit the video. Uh, and I think live stream is also what people are looking at nowadays. So I, I choose to go live stream. And when it is on my Facebook, even if you are not on during my uh, the live stream time, the exact time, it will still be available to uh, watch during uh, 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 after the live stream. That means after the live stream, you can still you can still watch this same video. So I thought that I will uh, uh, do a live stream whenever I can. Uh, so that is natural. I get to meet with y'all. Uh, you can also uh, uh, comment and tell me if you're around. So uh, otherwise, I will continue my, my, my topic for the day. So just let me do a bit of an in introduction. This is actually the second time I'm doing live stream. I'm still working around the different things that I uh, am uh, trying to do. You see, the thing is, I am really very passionate about sewing and here in Malaysia, uh, we find that there are less and less people who knows how to sew. So that is the reason why uh, I focus on helping people get started on sewing. So I have uh, 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 developed a six part course, uh, which actually I was uh, intending to, to do in a workshop, right, uh, for for the beginners um, to help them get started. But you see, the thing is, uh, here in Malaysia, we have this re restricted um, restricted movement control uh, order that is in, in Malaysia, and we are not allowed to, to run workshops, are not uh, allowed to have uh, um, gatherings. Huh? So because of that, I'm still very passionate about uh, getting uh, getting people to get started, not helping, actually help people to get started. Uh, so if you are a complete new person, that means you don't know uh, very much about sewing and don't know much about sewing machine, right? I think uh, this course will be helpful to you and for you, right? So now just in case any of you are here live, just uh, uh, uh comment on the comment section and I will know that someone is there. Otherwise, it's all right. I will continue with this whole uh, uh, video uh, just to introduce a little bit about myself. Uh, okay, uh, today, what we're going to do today, today I'm actually going to uh, talk about uh, the video. I'm sorry, <laughs> a bit confused, a bit disorientated, yeah? So, I want to talk about the six-part course. Firstly, I want to talk about the six-part course for beginners. Now, this course uh, only benefit beginners, right? So, uh, if you are already a seasoned sewer, I don't think you will benefit from it. So, what to uh, just to show you a little bit about the course, right? Let me. Uh, show you a bit about my course content too right so right so so this will be a beginner sewing program designed completely for newbies so if you totally do not know anything about this uh, sewing this program i believe is comprehensive and helpful uh, for you I hope one of these days to actually uh, have one of my customers come on uh, to uh, tell you how she feels about uh, the course that she is doing, okay? So part three at the end, uh, okay, sorry. The, at the end of the program, okay, the participants of this course will be able to manage your sewing machine, right? And then you will 
uh, acquire the basic fundamental skills that are necessary uh, and techniques that are necessary to start off in your sewing, right? So uh, then after acquiring the, all these skills, you can move on to other things that you like to do. Uh, you can possibly uh, go on to making bags, making clothes. You can do quilting, uh, patchwork, applique. Okay, there are a lot of things that you can do with sewing. But what we want to give you in this beginner six-part course is the basic skill, right? Basic skills that uh, you will need to start off, right? So you want to know what is in part one. Part one, I will... Uh, I will uh, tell you about the various guides that you can use to help you sew a straight line. And today we are doing one of this, one part of the part one course. Part one, we have actually a few videos. All, all these are done on videos, right? And then when I come on live stream, I can talk about the videos uh, with you and answer questions to help you along in the course, right? So today I'm doing part one, uh, which part one actually have three sewing straight lines uh, episodes, right? And I'm just showing uh, one of the episodes, right? And at, every, at the end of every project, we will do, uh, sorry, at end of every part, we will have a project where you make something simple. That project's intention is mainly for you to apply what you have learned, okay, to make that item. So the focus is not on the project, it's not how, how nicely designed the project is, but it is applying your techniques, right? So part two, you will be doing other stitches and uh, it, that, that is available on your sewing machine and the project is making a, a face mask, right? And then part three, we do buttonholes. Your machine will come with a buttonhole foot and usually also with a zipper foot, and we will make a zipper pouch, right? Part four, right, we will make, uh, we will uh, use your presser foot to do the edging techniques, and the project is making a very simple, very simple, okay, a hardly, no, no, uh, uh, no, no drafting skirt, right? And then, um, part five, we are doing shorts. Okay, in this, I will provide you the template for the shorts. You will cut up the template and you make your shorts. And here, we are applying what you learn in dealing with the seams, right? So you see, uh, when you are starting off, I'm sure you just have, let's say, a home sewing machine. Right? An electronic one, not the manual pedal one, okay? The electronic pedal one. With the electronic pedal one, you can actually, uh, the, the electronic uh, machine, not, not the pedal one, sorry, the electronic machine, you can actually deal with all the sims on your shorts. The shorts is can be made completely with your sewing machine. You do not have to run out to go and get your sims, you know, uh, search with a serger. You don't have to go to the shops to get serger uh, to sew your sims, right? So these shorts and even the skirt earlier on, you can do completely with your sewing machine and I will show you how to do that. Right, and then uh, the last part, it's where I'm going to show you a bit about different type of fabric, right? You, you have different type of fabric and there is a particular gadget that we would like to fit onto your machine, which is called a walking foot and we will handle stretchable fabric, yeah? Stretchable fabric, yeah? Stretchable fabric, uh, like a t-shirt, you can do, you can choose making a t-shirt or you you can also choose to make a, a a panty for ladies panty yeah so because these two items need stretchable fabric for you to do so that's what we uh we do uh in our six parts right so uh let's come back to here so if you if you are a uh, if you are a, uh, someone who already own a sewing machine right and you just want to take the course you can right and our course come with all the materials for you to do uh to do the 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 parts every parts have material with it right if you don't have a sewing machine and you like to start off uh doing the course right uh you can and for uh, for this month, December, the, the the my customers who who buy sewing machines from me, right? 
uh, you you get to do the video course free. And that means I will send you the video course for free. But the material uh, for all the that you need to use is not free. Yeah. Uh? So uh, then the material uh, I can supply it, um, uh, and I will let you know how much it is every every pack because uh, different packs use different type of material. When you make garment, the material is bigger, so the cost will be more. Right. So you can, if you get the machine from me, you get the videos for free for this month, December. Right. Now, if you already have a machine and you just want to do the course, you can. Please uh, uh, contact me uh, by WhatsApp or by sending me an email to uh, Jen at messagingtofit.com. Right. Go to my Facebook page and uh, and message me if you need to right and uh, and uh, i will be able to tell you all about the costing i just want to tell you that for me i have used mainly the japanese brand sewing machine i have used juki machine i use singer i use brother i have even used the jonome machine and i have owned all these four brands and i still have uh, them okay with me except that i sold some because i don't need so many right so now if you want to get a juki i can help you get a juki you want a singer i can also brother i can also so you can also ask me about what's the difference between the three brands on a personal side you can whatsapp me and i will tell you about the three brands what are the pros and cons of the different brands and what uh what I want to tell you, how do you choose a sewing machine? What are the important things, right? When you want to buy a sewing machine. So for a beginner, because it will be like, I think uh, I have spoken to a few of friends of mine who wanted to buy a sewing machine, right? It's like, wow, there are so many things outside. The machine has so many features. Do I need to buy all the features? Do I need so many things, you know? You can buy the feature and if nobody shows you, you don't know how to use it. So you can check with me. And I will be able to help you. So I'm uh, talking about this course. Let's come back to the, the course. If you get the machine with me, the video tutorial course is included with the machine. Now, if you already have a sewing machine, you can also just do the course with me. And, uh, and when you pay for the course, I will also supply the material for the course. So, so machine owners, right? You get the course for free, but you will have to just pay a little bit yeah, for the fabric. I mean, of course, it will cost less, right? Because it's just for the material, right? So let's um, let's go on to my part one. Um, part one. Part one. Uh, today, I'm showing part one where we will talk about... Actually, we are going to talk about sewing the straight line you see when uh, when i uh, when in the course i will actually start you off with sewing a straight line on a, a paper that has straight line drawn on it so you learn to place your needle on the on the line and sew straight following what is drawn right so but today i am i am showing you a, a another part of the course where you have a complete blank sheet Okay, if it is in my material pack, I will supply you with uh, A4 size uh, fabric, right? A4 size fabric, completely blank. Now, can you sew a straight line on it? Yes, you certainly can. And in this video, I'm showing you how to use the items that is on your sewing machine already, right? And sew a straight line still sew a straight line okay and this is part of the videos for my participants in the course right straight line just using the presser foot as a guide so this is your presser foot the side is the guide that you will use so what we will do to sew the straight line is align your fabric see the side of your fabric to the side of your presser foot right so we're going to start at the top and you will see how i will still be able to get a straight line 
and you too will be able to get a straight line with the presser foot as a guide. So, kneel down, move your hand you. Make sure, once more, make sure that the end of your fabric is at the side of the presser foot. Okay, move your needle down, presser foot down. Right? Okay, I moved it a bit because I was looking at the camera. Okay, now, so make sure this, then remember to do your reverse away. Okay, reverse. Go three steps forward, two, three, press the reverse lever, go backwards, two, three, and then release your reverse lever, and then you will go forward again. And still continue sewing, making sure that you are your the side of your presser foot is against the side of your fabric. You see, and you will still have a straight line. All the way. So when you come to the end of the sewing, stop, press your reverse lever, go backwards, two or three, sorry, three or four stitches, stop with the needle down, let go of your reverse lever and come forward again. And that's it. And you are done. Okay, make sure your needle is up. Lift the presser foot lever and pull your sewing away. Right? This will be the practice. Pull your sewing away from yourself. Then only cut the thread. Let's have a look at the straight line. It is a straight line sewn without any drawn lines. Okay, there will be times that it's like that and most of the time when we sew with the presser foot as a guide, it is a quarter inch allowance from the edge. So how do we sew the second line? So I just want to show up to this part actually, uh, uh, the rest of the video I will I, I do make mistakes in my videos and then I will talk, tell all my uh, all my um, participants about the mistake I made so that they also learn from some of the mistakes that we can make. You know, just now the mistake was the thread actually came out of the needle. So you have to thread the, the, the thread again. So the trick is uh, pull the thread longer so that you have more allowance, right? And then you uh, will not have to keep trading uh, Keep trading the uh, keep trading the the trade right. So I hope you you see uh, from the video you were able to see that actually sewed a straight line, right, with nothing drawn on that piece of cloth, right. And then you can sew the second line, aligning the presser foot to your first line of sewing, and then you sew down again, and you. With that, you can actually sew straight line. This is a very, to me, at least to me, Janice, for a start, this is a very basic skill that you will need to have, right? Uh, in terms of sewing, sewing straight line, of course, is very important, right? So it's how to get your straight line done. And then, you see, sometimes when we make projects, when we make things, we don't draw every time. You know, draw on it. So when we don't draw, how are we going to know that, you know, from the seam to where we want to sew is, is a same distance. We want it to be a same distance, right? So by using the presser foot is one of the way. And then I have a, a, another way that I show in another part of the uh, course where you use something else also in your sewing machine, in your machine itself, and you can still sew straight line. Okay, that's what the course is about, right? And uh, uh, that is part one. And then after that, we make the uh, uh, sewing the straight line to make the drawstring back. 
and dealing with all the edges of the fabric. So that is uh, that is uh, my just a bit showing you how does the course work and is there any interaction interaction with me? Yes. Okay, you can come on live here and then talk to me about some of the challenges you have faced while sewing. Or you can also, I also have a special closed Facebook group. The first, uh, closed uh, Facebook group uh, is only for my uh, paid participants or my machine owners. So they will be inside there and then uh, I will interact with them. Then I will give them a link where they can actually talk back to me right uh, uh talk back to me and ask me question there and then while i'm doing my session yeah so so this is what i uh, this is the mode of uh, teaching that i have uh, uh where we will interact because we we cannot have a workshop in person right so i think we are still able to communicate quite well uh, via the camera and with all this technology and I am learning to manage it. So I think uh, I would I would say that I am getting more and more comfortable with managing the uh, system and I, I look forward to interacting with my participants uh, uh, on the private private chat group, right? So that's all for today. Right. If you need, you want to know more about the course for the sewing machine, want to know about sewing machine and my six part beginners course, do uh, uh, private message me and uh, I will try to help you with it. Thank you so much. Have a nice day today.